through empty pockets and eyes full of hope she looks for a world where women have a scope with precision she moves the needle over the cloth as it bends with this not only the old fabric but her way of life she mends overcoming the lonely deserts of creatively blocked sands for women's upliftment we now join hands with this vision of directing rural women to move one step closer to financial independence we at enactus maitri present before you project swarnam a mission which aims to transform human activities to make them more environment friendly the fashion industry has been evolving at an increasing rate for the last few decades due to a shift in fashion trends leading to an intensification of the needs and wants of the customers thereby creating expectations to produce more garments at reduced prices This wastage of garments in hundreds of tons results in poor working conditions, overconsumption of natural resources, and lastly, global warming. Considering the environmental and social impact of production, donating, reusing, and recycling clothing to extend their usable life are some promising steps towards achieving the vision of a more sustainable industry. A small step taken in this direction is Project Swarnam. Currently, three women from the Hands for Help NGO in Mayur Vihar are our beneficiaries. We aim to provide them a chance to become financially stable and self-sufficient. आपके लिए स्वर्णिम क्या है? स्वर्णिम एक संस्था है जिससे हम बेरोजगारों को काम दे सकते हैं जो बेरोजगार हैं उन्हें हम इनकम इनकम प्रोवाइड करवा सकते हैं बेरोजगारी खत्म कर सकते हैं आपके हिसाब से स्वर्णिम ने किस समस्या का हल निकाला है हमारे हिसाब से स्वर्णिम ने बेरोजगारी का हल निकाला है जिससे हम बेरोजगारी खत्म कर सकते हैं स्वर्णिम ने ये जो समस्या है इसका समाधान कैसे किया है स्वर्णिम ने समस्या का समाधान पुराने कपड़ों से नए कपड़ों में डेवलप करके किया है नए कपड़ों में नई डिज़ाइन डाल के जिससे पुराने कपड़े भी यूज में हो जा आ जाते हैं चीज़ें यूज हो जाती हैं चीज़ें वेस्ट नहीं होती हैं और लोगों को नया काम भी मिल जाता है वी स्टार्ट ऑफ बाय कलेक्टिंग ओल्ड गार्मेंट्स थ्रू डीलर्स ऑफ सेकंड हैंड क्लोथ्स एंड थ्रू डोनेशन ड्राइव्स व्हिच विल बी यूज्ड एज अ बेस मटीरियल एंड प्रमोट गार्मेंट रीफर्बिशिंग एंड अप स्केलिंग a series of meetings are held in order to seek ideas and inspirations for the transformation of the clothes collected this involves finding the right design for every garment which has to be refurbished the next step is to provide a beneficiaries with vocational training and guidance so that they have a better understanding of current trends persisting in the marketplace we aim to inculcate in them thrift skills such as tie and dye and cloth painting for refurbishing these old clothes once these clothes have been designed and developed and are ready to be sold we begin with the sales and marketing operations this includes indulging in product photography and looking for prospective collaborations with existing thrift stores finally these clothes would be packaged and sold through our online thrift store in a d2c channel the sdgs covered through swarnim are Fast fashion sends an estimated 18.6 million tons of clothes to landfills. 95% of the clothing that we chuck away could have a second life. Through projects one name we seek not to promote sustainable clothing but a sustainable lifestyle. We strive to ensure that slum women become self-sufficient and financially stable and give them the opportunity to lead a healthier and a happy life. With time we aim to minimize the concept of fast fashion by using one piece of used clothing a year instead of a new one we could save about 6 pounds of carbon dioxide emissions this would result in a reduction of textile waste the project's initial money was obtained from the savings from a previously launched project which added up to an amount of rupees 10860 Besides, a profit of rupees twenty thousand was gathered from webinars and sponsorships, and was also utilized for this purpose. Apart from funding raw materials, the money was also utilized to support the beneficiaries' primary training, and a portion of it was used for research and development. The future prospects of Project Swarnim are as follows.